Hi, my name is Joan King, and today we're back with Tickle Time by Sandra Boynton. Everybody's favorite, we all love her. Her reindeer Bob, the pigs, the hippos, and the rhinos. We love them all. But this is time for kitty time. Here we go. Again, I'm going to use my magic ruler because I want to make it. He is about two inches wide. So I'm going to do, because I want to try to make him the same size. You can eyeball it, but I want it to look like him. So he's about two and a half inches. So I'm going to measure down two and a half inches right there and there and then go over here make a nice box and he should fit in this box almost okay first this is what we're going to draw see this shape here it's really a big egg shape that's slightly smaller at the top see that it's not round it's it's an egg okay so i'm going to start in the middle and go down because i want to go out to that side And then I'm going to go sort of like this. There. Wait a minute. Did I add his feet? Oh, no. His egg, the egg comes up to about here because his feet have to go in. I forgot about his feet. That's a bad mistake. Okay. There, his feet are right here. Okay. In fact, we might as well just draw them. He's got one, two three toes. One, two, three toes. So we've done his feet. That's pretty good. Now here's his head. His head is kind of flat on the top. Did you notice that? Maybe he got dropped on his head when he was a kitty. Okay, now he has about this much space between there and there. So we'll start the ear here and here. Now they're just nice round ears. They're not very pointy. She does such wonderful work because she makes charming characters with almost no lines. Make that a little bigger. He's got three hairs coming out. And I'm going to erase this a little bit. And his hairs are kind of up on the top of his head. It's kind of hard. And his eyes are up real high and they're big. Okay, and this is the middle, so you want to put his eyes on each side of that middle line. A little bigger than that. We'll clean this up later. Oh, let's see, I think. Yeah, I think that's about right. Yeah, okay, and then the inside of the ears like this. Kind of looks like a bat so far. And he has a very big nose, and it comes down quite low. So... And then he has, he's not happy. Okay. Now, now he has big whiskers that come out like this. Two, three, one, two, three. Yeah. And then he has kind of, he's a shaggy cat. And then down here under his chin, he has his little paws are holding together. So we'll do this I'm gonna make it really really easy and do a circle here and then we'll just do one two three there and we'll clean that up and then he has a tiny bit of leg and here's this little stomach coming right there <sighs> now let's erase some of this After we sharpie it, we can erase everything that's showing up here. I want to, his eyes need to be cleaned up. Okay. Now, since we've kind of got him set here, we can figure out what's going on. Okay, now, 
Let's improve him a bit. Okay. His ears right here. Go around like that. That ear is too big. I think his fluff doesn't have to be exact. But anyway, he's got some ear here, ear here, and a little one here. Okay, now let's do circle. Circle. And his nose. Don't get hung up on these paws. They don't have to be fabulous. Now, the main thing are his personality whiskers. One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. Okay. Now, clean up a little more erasers. Do we have time to sharpen here or not? You want to stop? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let's. Do his tail. Oh, I forgot. Oh, the best part. The tail. <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay, let's sharpie. Okay. have to do the eyes very careful. They're the windows to the soul. 